A major incident in the U.S. state of Maryland, where a cargo ship collided with the Francis Scott Key Bridge in Baltimore on Tuesday, causing its collapse. A search and rescue efforts are underway with six members of a road construction crew still unaccounted for. Shin Sebek reports. On Tuesday, the Francis Scott Key Bridge in Baltimore, Maryland, U.S., collapsed after a massive cargo ship, which officials say lost power, crashed into it. A Singapore registered vessel with the name Dali, D A L I, uh, which made contact with the Francis Scott Key Bridge in Baltimore, Maryland, at around 1.30 a.m. this morning. Two people were pulled from the river below following the accident. One was rescued with no major injury and the other was taken to hospital reportedly in a serious condition. Search and rescue efforts are ongoing for six members of a road crew who are working on the bridge, but according to an official from their construction firm, they are presumed dead considering the depth of water and length of time since the collision. Maryland Governor Wes Moore said in a briefing on Tuesday that the vessel signaled a problem with its power, leading authorities to stop traffic on the bridge between the ship's mayday call and the collision, noting the warning likely saved lives. The port of Baltimore, where the key bridge was positioned, stands as the U.S. premier hub for automobile imports and exports, as it's deemed a key entry point to the eastern U.S. and the Atlantic Ocean. In the aftermath of the disaster, the Maryland state government declared a state of emergency and put an indefinite hold on port operations, potentially impacting the domestic auto supply chain. Following the accident, U.S. President Joe Biden held a briefing where he said he would visit Baltimore at the earliest opportunity. He reassured the public that although investigations into the cause of the accident are ongoing, there is no indication of terrorism. At this time, we have no other indication, no other reason to believe there's any intentional act here. Biden stressed the importance of concentrating on search and rescue efforts at this time, with plans to promptly move forward with bridge reconstruction. He also pledged that the federal government will pay the full cost of rebuilding the key bridge and ask for the cooperation of Congress in this matter. Shin Sebyeok, Arirang News.